Hi, welcome to today's tasting note. Uh, this is the wine I'm doing today. This is Gulp Hablo, uh, orange wine. Well, it says orange white wine on the back. 2021. Um, it's a combination of Sauvignon Blanc and Verdeo. Um, now, orange wine is basically white wine made in the red wine way, so skin contact. Um, this is biodynamic, vegan, low sulfur. So, all the buzzwords for a good old hippie wine. It's even got, you know, cloudiness, you know, a few bits floating in it. So, I think we're going sort of natural wine-ish way here. Um, this is the Para family that uh, own this. They established their uh, business in 1993 in La Mancha in Spain. And on the nose, so full disclosure, I've got an inherent bias against orange wine. Um, as, a, as, a, as, a, as, a, as a rule, there are some very, very good ones. Um, and I think that's that's what uh, you you need to look for. Um, just having something because it's orange, that doesn't do it for me. It has to be good. So um, so this at eighteen quid for actually a liter bottle, because this be a liter bottle, um, is something that I think you know it's at the cheaperish end of orange wines. You do tend to see quite a lot in that sort of twenty five to thirty five price point. I think a lot of the time it's just aiming for a sort of slightly hippie market, but on the nose on this, you've got this nice, so it, there is that phenolic element coming through first, so that real, um, almost uh, um, sort of uh, stony, flinty sort of aroma. Then there's some delicate, almost uh, uh, sort of floral, sort of daffodils or that sort of aroma. And then there's this hint, I'm getting a hint of plasticine, but, um, but it's, it's quite, it's quite, it's quite muted, but, you know, quite pleasant at the same time. That's weird, but I like it. It's a bombardment on your palate. You've got big, bold, uh, stony, flinty things coming on. Then you have a bundle load. Um, I've got people trying to come in. Bear with me. Sorry, that was uh, tourists trying to get into the shop at ten past nine in the morning. We're not allowed to open till ten. Um, anyway, um, so yeah, a bombardment on your palate. Big, bold, phenolicky things coming on. Um, but then you have this fantastic... Um, it's almost like a... It's almost like grapefruit and tart underripe oranges. And then there's a grass note coming through, a hay-like grass note, um, and 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 then sherbet at the end, just giving it a bit of juice at the end. I like this. I think this is silly. It's fun. It's tasty. It appeals to everyone who's got a sort of vegan bent or something like that, it's cracking. And at 18 quid, it's an absolute steal.